All right, welcome back, everybody, to Seven Days to Die on Alpha 21. This is the Ranger Apocalypse series, and I'm an old guy gaming. And uh, we are on our way to do this next job for Trader Wreck, but I thought I'd stop and do a little bit of random looting on the way there. We are looking for one more friggin' mechanical part, and it is just eluding us like something. Oh, look at that. Toilet pistol, except for it wasn't in a toilet. It was on a desk. Yeah, so uh, we've just been having a hard time finding that final mechanical part. So that we can make a wrench, so that we can then make a workbench, so that we can then go and um, fix up R Ranger Station Charlie and finish fixing up Ranger Station Delta. Once we got that done, then we're going to go out and about and start uh, doing some more exploring of the map and looking for new Ranger Stations to fix up, as is uh, in line with our the theme of this playthrough here. Okay, let's put that down there. I'm going to grab this cement. What is in these green bags? Oh, it's clay. Okay. Yeah, I don't want the clay right now. Definitely want the cement, though. And uh, there's some loot kind of up that way that we'll take a quick look at before we move on. I'm not planning on looting this entire place. But uh, with all this cement, you just can't just can't pass it up. We did look in there, right? Yeah. Okay, let's go up here. Okay, we got a utility cart. And some acid. That's nice. Hey, working stiffs, come on, either a wrench or mechanical part. Come on, come on, come on. Ah, harvesting tools. Okay. All right, I think that's all the more time we're going to spend up here. So let's uh, head on out. Check the trashes because sometimes you can find mechanical parts in trash. Two birds' nests right next to each other. Why not? We could try this Mo Power. Uh, car over here. Vehicle. Okay. Robotics and wiring. Two wiring. And some robotic parts, which we can sell. This looks like a trader compound, but it's not. Oh, yeah. I, haven't we already done this? Well, here again, I don't know if we've done this POI in this series or one of my other Alpha 21 series. Just hard to say, you know? I'm not screwing around with bikers. No siree, Bob. All right, let's uh, grab the cement. Is this car lootable? Oh, it is. Nice. Come on, mechanical part. Man, another thing of acid. All right. Did I read some kind of book that makes it easy for me to find acid in cars and stuff? I don't remember. Very possible that I did. Lots of resources in this yard. Yeah, this is the place with all the potatoes. I mean, again, I'm not sure if I did that in this series or if we did it in our previous one, but this is a great place to gather resources. So we're going to take advantage of this. Oh, shit. Where are you, puppy? Okay. 
let's grab the chrysanthemum too. We're probably going to be out after dark, but that's all right. I think we can probably deal with that. Oh, some shrooms. Corn. More cement. What's up with all the cement around the seven days to die worlds? <laughs> it's like, it seems like lots of cement all over the place. We are already maxed out. Okay. I think that's all the double looting we're going to do. Is there a mailbox out in front? Yes, there is. Let's double loot that too. We already know that, but we can sell it. Um, let's see. We'll scrap these. We'll do a quick repair on these and chuck the stone. Don't really need the goldenrod so much. Okay, let's stick a couple things in here. And is there a dog in here? No. I'm Arlene though. We'll double loot this and then we'll then we'll start the quest. Got a bag. Nice. Oh wow, look at all the cement. Goodness gracious sakes alive. Okay, let's get this party started. Now, I'm going to actually make a drop chest because we just got too much stuff. All right, when sneaking, you always land silently unless you are taking damage and jump time is not reduced. That's a very good one. So we can jump off of things while we're in sneak mode and not make any noise when we land. Uh, we're starting to get low-ish on nine mils. So we have to be cognizant of that situation. All right, how do we start this quest? Oh, we have to go up above here. Nice. It's so a second grandpa's awesome sauce. Come on, nine mils. There we go. Got a few nine mils. Okay, we're good in here. It's all pretty decent stuff. There we go. All right, we got ourselves a decent jacket now. Okay, let's take this back off. Modify, take the pocket mod off of here. Put it on here. And where? That, I think we'll just end up selling. Or we'll save it for desert wear until we come across the duster, I guess. Got our next skill point. Let's take a look at that. So, uh, let's do let's do parkour next. So now we can reduce stamina cost of jumping by 30%, increase safe fall distance by four meters, and never get a broken leg when falling. Nice. I love it. 
Parkour is such a, a good skill. Good perk to have. Okay, check the bookcase here. Handy land. Wall hammer quality two. Handgun guy and knife guy. Pipe pistol quality three. Explosives. Medical. Nice little collection of stuff there. Okay, are we supposed to go out this way? I think so. Okay, eliminates him. Tango down. Okay, this is a nice cloth helmet, but it's uh, not as good as what we currently have, so we'll fix it up, sell it, and if possible, put a mod on it too first, if I have an extra mod for that. So we get to go down there. All right, let's get this ready. I don't have to worry about anything coming from that direction. At least uh, not so as it'll come right through immediately. Cooking. Nice, now we can make hobo stew. We probably better start Hanging on to all spoiled meat now. It's been sort of optional up until now. What is this? This is a retrieve. Okay. Love the silencer on the pistol. Cement on the dining room table. Of course, that's perfectly natural for the Seven Days to Die world. What else would you expect to be on the dining room table? I mean, come on. nighttime. Oh, another downstairs apartment here. And because we have feral sense on, um, that does get the, uh, attract the attention of the outside Zikaroos. So he did? I think so. Oh, that's a lot of Zikaroos. Dang, what do we get? Like a wandering horde come through right when nightfall hit? Figures. All right, let's reinforce that door. That's a that's a landmine. Not exactly sure where they all are. Oh, they're here. Okay. That's a lot of Zeke, so we're going to reinforce here. Marley. Nurse Nancy. Here comes more. 
Yeah, we definitely had a wandering horde come through right when nightfall hit. But you know what? It's free XP for us. In fact, you know what? Well, now nah, we'll just keep our agility glasses on for the extra dismemberment chance. Come on down, boys and girls. I'm going to... Ah, uh, you know what? Darn it. Uh, I left all my food back at the base. All right. Well, we're not in terrible shape. I don't really want to eat that. I want to save it for chili dogs and stuff. That's a landmine. We don't want to mess with that. Okay, let's dispatch this guy. Oh, he's feral. Dang. He dead anyway. He's feral too. Okay, let's take one of these. We got him kind of breaking in over there too. All right, we're not messing with this guy. He hits like a Mack truck. He'll break this block in a couple of hits. And with there's too, still too many Zeeks around for me not to keep that block intact for the moment. Okay, let's, uh, let's keep looting. And we'll keep an eye on back here. Let's close that too. There we go. Get some cornmeal. Some of that crap that we'll probably end up throwing out. Are you dead yet, Marlene? You are now. More? Not yet. Still nobody there. Oh, look at that. All right, we'll be going up there. Where did you come from? Oh, he must have come in the house and then dropped down through there, I think. We are getting a crap ton of acid. I, I must have read a book. You know, find more acid and loot or whatever the hell those books are called. All right, let's check this chemistry, uh, chemistry station. Nope, don't do that. There's a weapons bag. Uh, let's put our lucky looters on with the good loot. All right, that's not really worth hanging on to. We're going to scrap it. Let's repair this and then get rid of this. We don't need that. We don't need that. We don't need that. We don't need those. We'll scrap this into iron. We don't need those. Actually, you know what, though? Uh... Darling, you're tough. All right, put that there for a minute. All right, I'm going to eat these because we're kind of sort of hungry. And we still have lots of red tea to counter, counter it, so. All right, I guess that's all we need to worry about down here. Up we go. That's either a comp or Hawaii Five O. Neither one of those guys are good news. Okay, we're gonna. Close 
close that. Another reason why we need a workbench ASAP is so we can start making our own 9 mil ammo. Because we are really low now. Got some food here. Let's eat that right now. Close pile. Oh shit. Man, so much loot in this place. I mean, if you if you consider everything that we looted outside before we even got into the house, Sell those. That son of a bitch infected us. All right, well, we're going to have to get back to our base before it hits 5%, but we're just about done here, so. Maybe we'll luck out and find an antibiotic or a honey. No, but that's pretty good stuff, too. Uh, let's ditch that. And let's ditch the three bones. This is worth fixing up and selling. Don't need the chrysanthemum seed. Um, I think we'll hang on to everything else at the moment. But we are going to have to make room for all this other stuff. Alright, we'll get the cement. And... I guess that's what this does. It opens that up. Okay. Let's check the fat loots. Um, do we have... Don't we already have those? No, we don't. Modify. Reduces fall damage. Nice. Okay, so that gets us everything except for this hood. So we're going to ditch the feathers. Savage Country box and a Poppin' Pills box. All right. This we definitely want, and I got some mods I can put on this too to make it even more valuable. Let's eat this, and we can take both of those. Uh, here we go. Honey. That's exactly what we needed. Very good. Okay, we need to take that vitamin, so well now, we're, now what are we going to give up? Um, probably three ears of corn. Yeah. There we go. Okay. Where's our bike? Over here. Uh, we should be able to just do this jump now because we got the impact racers and we have parkour three. So, yeah, we're in pretty good shape. All right. Do I have room in here for stuff? A little bit. We got Yo coming in. Are you normal Yo or Feral Yo? Normal. All 
right, we'll put that there. Nothing else there will fit. Got all of this crap too. My goodness. All right, well, I'm just going to, oh, there's my food. I'm just going to have to make a couple of trips. That's all there is to it. So uh, what I'm going to do, guys, is haul all this crap back to the base, make a couple of trips, and then I might do a little more random nighttime looting. Alright guys, so I, I did a little bit of random looting this. Uh, I'm sure I will show you in a montage or something. Um, for the rest of the night after, you know, getting most of our, our stuff. And uh, we got another level. So let's go to agility and we're going to put that in. I think, I think we're negative here because we have either, either because we are encumbered or because we have an abrasion. I'm not sure. Well, actually, does it tell us? This can be due to status effect. Or no, yeah. Um, or, well, actually, hold on. It's Yeah, it's because we're not wearing these. That's why. Okay. All right. So let's go to... We can't do whirlwind until we get seven. We got parkour. Uh, let's do from the shadows. I think that's what we'll do next. Yeah. Okay. So we're basically going to have to keep the agility glasses on almost all the time, in, unless we're like looting, uh, you know, in loot or something like that. Okay. Let's spend the rest of, well, the, yeah, let's spend the next hour and a half or so this morning looking for more mechanical parts while we wait for the trader to open. So we're just going to kind of do some random looting here. And I'm going to put a few things in. Oh, actually, you know what? I can't because all that stuff we're going to sell to the trader. Man, we are full already? For goodness sakes. Uh, uh, I don't want to throw 54 bones away. We can throw two paper away. Um, We can scrap these. We'll go ahead and throw 36 lead away. Everything else I think I want to hang. Well, yeah, let's throw one cloth away, too. I think we'll keep everything else. All right, let's just pop in here. This is a three-star. Why are there graves over here? Oh, for goodness sakes. You know what I think I'm going to have to do? Um, I can make a, a level five pipe assault rifle uh, because we're so low on nine mils. I think we're going to probably have to do that. I hear snake. Where's he at? Come here, sneaky snake. Really? Yeah, what's up with all the graves in the yard? What is this place called? 
Bill Gear's place with graves in the yard? There's something bad wrong about that, Bobby. All right. You know, we should probably watch out for landmines in the yard. <laughs> Ooh, look at that. Victims. Okay, took those guys out. Oh man, another dog? Okay, let's go back around this way. There's a lever there for some reason. I don't know what it's for. Uh, seems to me like that would be a good place for us to find a mechanical part. Oh. You're the one that I heard. Have some bleeds. Check this. There we go. We finally found that elusive mechanical part we've been looking for for five million years. Not really five million, but you know what I mean. Okay, now we can finally make ourselves a wrench. Since we're here, can we open this door? Let's just see what's in here. Oh, you know what? We need to watch our health. We're really low on health. After we're done with agility... Um, whoa, shit. We're gonna... We're gonna put some points into intellect so we can put some points into physician. We must have killed Arlene yet. Yeah, we bled her out. Okay. And Janitor Joe never woke up through all of that. Now he'll definitely never wake up. Let's check here. Uh, worth fixing up and selling for sure, but we have a purple one now. Toolbox. Check these shelves. That's good stuff. Sure, why not? Ooh, 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 look at that, you guys. Wow! I don't even know if I can make a level one of those. That, as I like to say, was worth the price of admission. Nice. Okay, so we... Oh, man, we got so much crap in our inventory. What are we going to do? Uh, we can scrap those and take that. Oh, man, that was a beautiful find. Fantabulous. Um... We can take those immediately, and I, I don't want to pass up on four oil either. Oh, there we go. A solution presented itself. Look at that. Nice. Okay. Yeah, we're not going to... Uh, what time is it? Well, all right. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go back to the base. I'm going to make the wrench. Then we're going to go to the trader, do the turn in, and wrap up this episode. Except for, we might as well check this mailbox here because it's there. And we might as well check this trash here because it's there. And this one too. We uh, Shoot, we can't take any of that. Okay, here, let's do this momentarily. Repair that. Now we can check the rest of those. Get those back. Boom. I like that stuff, but you know what? We got to stop. We just got to stop. <laughs> we have loot asitis. Where's our house? It's over that way. All right, I'll meet you guys at the trader. All right, guys, we are back at the trader here. And we're going to do our turn in and sell some stuff to him. Didn't we and we get a wrench. <laughs> That's okay, though. I'm not complaining. It's a level three wrench, because if we made our own, we'd only be able to make a level one. So there we go. Okay. That works for me, man. That absolutely works for me. Let's sell a few things to this dude. Uh, we might hang on to those shotgun parts, actually. 
Okay, we are up to 12,015 coin. And he doesn't restock till day 10. Thanks, buddy. All right, we will take another job from him. Oh, he's got it infested. Nice. At the mausoleum. Ooh, that's going to be fun. Okay, so here is what's going to happen. I'm going to go back to the base. I'm going to get my inventory management situated. And then uh, the plan for the next episode is that we're going to hike back, a.k.a. ride the bike, to Ranger Station Charlie, where we first started this series. And we're going to fix it up because that's what our mission is. And then after that, we will come back here and we might, uh, there's a couple more things I want to do to Ranger Station Delta too, which is our, our current base. And I might, I might continue working for Rekt until we hit tier three. I'm passing up way too many bird's nests here. And then we will go uh, start Visiting new locations is what I'm trying to say. I'm, I'm sorry, my brain's like, I'm trying to think of three different things at the same time here. And um, I, I'm not sure if we'll finish uh, or get to tier three with Rack yet or not. We'll see. But uh, one way or the other, you'll know what the plan is when I know what the plan is. <laughs> so... All right, with that being said, thanks everybody for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, and share the video. And we'll catch you all in the next episode. Bye bye.